All right, so this is uh, Simpson's rule. It looks a lot similar to the trapezoidal rule. Um, but what Simpson did is that he, uh, he used the, what is it called? Uh, integration of a second degree polynomial to help him kind of modify uh, the trapezoidal rule, which actually gives us a better estimation of the integration. So uh, again, we are doing number one from 4.6. So we have this still squared dx and n equals four. So again, um, this is how many trapezoids we're gonna have. So we're gonna go up uh, by uh, half half uh, half intervals of x. So we're going to start off with b minus a over 3n. So we're going to do 2 minus 0, b and a, over uh, 3 times 4, right? It's f uh, n is 4. So we're going to start with f of uh, 0, sorry, plus 4 times f of uh, 1 half plus 2 f of 1 plus 4 again times f of 1 and a half plus and then there's again nothing here so it's just f of 2 Um, so notice that it alternates from 4 to 2, 4 to 2, until you get to the end, and then there's you're just multiplying by 1. Um, in the trapezoidal rule, they just go up by, they do a 2 here, a 2 here, and a 2 here. But now we're alternating back and forth, and in trapezoidal rule, this is a 2. We have changed it now to a 3. Um... So let's do this real quick. 2 divided by 12 times 0 uh, for x squared. So 0 squared is 0. 1 half squared is going to be 1 fourth. 1 squared is going to be 1. Oh, I forgot my. Uh. 1 and 1 half squared is going to be 9 over 4 again. We're multiplying by 4. And then 2 squared is 4. So we get 2, 12. Uh, so this is going to be 4 times 1 fourth, which is 1, plus 2 times 1, which is 2, plus 4 times 9 over 4, which is 9, plus 4, now we gotta distribute this, so it's gonna be two over 12. And then we're doing two times two over 12, so we're gonna get four over 12, plus nine times two over 12, which is gonna be 18 over 12. And then four times two over 12 is gonna be eight over 12. This will equal um, six. Six plus 18 is gonna be uh, 24. 24 plus 8 is going to be 30, uh, sorry, 2 plus 4 is going to be 6, 6 plus 18 is going to be 24, 24 plus 8 should be 32 over 12. This is going to equal, we can take a 4 out of each of these, 8 over 3. Um, and I believe that is 2.667, but double check me on that.